Hey guys, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel in another video. You guys have asked this and requested I comment on this video regarding abortion and women's rights and so forth. Um, this is kind of controversial, but we'll get right into it. Um, I don't want to shy away. I just want to say this right here. So if this is going to make you click off or unsubscribe, I am pro-choice. So if that makes you leave my channel, I'm um, sorry to see you leave, but I definitely understand. Um, I believe that women have the right to choose with their bodies. Um, and there are so many circumstances that to give a blanket answer would just kind of be unjust. But let's get into this video. You're confused because you think I'm saying something that I'm not. Well, tell me what you're no, saying. What I'm telling you, I'm being very clear. You cannot say you are pro-life when you vote against prenatal care for the mother. You cannot say you are pro-life when you vote against Head Start. You cannot say you are pro-life when you do not want to expand Medicaid to keep hospitals open. You cannot say you are pro-life when you have OBGYNs who are not available in your state. You cannot say you are pro-life when you have black women who are dying at a higher rate during childbirth and you do nothing public policy-wise to fix it. You cannot say you are pro-life if you allow infant mortality rates to be sky high in areas where there are black and brown people. What that tells me is you are anti-abortion. You are not pro-life. Right. Because if right. you are pro-life, right. you care about the child in the womb right. and when the child is out. You. And if you are pro-life, you are standing there with black folks when their kids are killed by cops. That's you are right. not silent. So Come if you are pro-life, be pro-life from the womb to the tomb, Come but on. not just in the womb. Okay. You're confused.